so you woke up. Well, well, where am I? What is this place? Who are you? Fear not. I'm Princess Peach. Princess Peach? But how do I get here? Well, you see, after the storm cleared, I went on a walk. After I arrived at the river, I found you unconscious on the shore. That's right. Mario was carried by the storm to the riverbank where Princess Peach found him. So that's what happened. Thank you, Princess Peach. I'm Mario. I come from the neighboring village to learn about the world. Oh, really? Princess Peach was very taken with a cute little Mario. Your name's Mario, right? You can stay here for your studies. Mario was overjoyed to hear this. To be able to learn alongside such a beautiful princess, he considered himself very lucky. Ever since that day, Princess Peach never left home without Mario. <gasps> so cute, so pretty, Princess Peach. I hope you give me a good response today. Of course you say yes this time, right? <laughs> King Koopa loved Princess Peach so much, he asked her to marry him every day. I refuse. As I've told you several times, I have no intention of marrying a horrible dragon like you. What? King Koopa was a pirate boss who was accustomed to taking whatever he wanted by force. I won't allow it. I won't allow it. I won't allow it. King Koopa, Mario the Great is your opponent! Who are you? I won't let you lay a single finger on Princess Peach. Oh. <laughs> What's so funny? Here we go! <laughs> you have a good spirit, little one! Mario! <laughs> I'll squish you good! Whoa! Mario! Yipe! A hard time. Mario put up his best fight, but he was no match for Koopa. Hey, you whoa, really are let me go. Fellow. You wouldn't even make a decent snack. Mario! I'll eat you just the same. Um. Mario! <laughs> Pretty Princess Peach. Now no one will bother us, Princess Peach. <gasps> this time for sure. I'm taking you home with me. Ooh. Yeah, go, yeah. Oh, 